In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys a very popular app called Cardiogram. Cardiogram takes the heart rate data from your Apple Watch and provides trend views for you. This app goes shows you a whole bunch of different summaries and compares you with other users of the app. So it's really cool. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the app and some of its features. Let's get started. When you up Cardiogram for the first time, immediately what will show up is a good afternoon, a good morning welcome message with your latest heart rate, which takes from your Apple Watch. So scrolling down, you see a timeline of your summary for the day. It shows you your resting, your step count, your peak beats per minute, and your sleep duration. Swiping to the right allows you to add a friend and shows you a comparison of the steps that you've done. Scrolling down, shows you your walking for the previous day. So on Saturday, I did a lot of walking. My average BPM was 116 and my peak BPM was 132. Scrolling to the right, it says that my heart rate zone was mostly moderate. It shows you that I didn't have anything in the high intensity range or the maximum range, but most of my, my walk was in the moderate range. Scrolling down, it shows you another walk that I did with the same information. It shows me a dance workout that I did on Saturday night. It shows you your average BPM and beats per minute. Now this shows it for all of the different um, activities that you've done. You're gonna get a card like this. Scrolling down, you see the entire summary for Saturday and it shows you where those activities took place as long as the total step count, your my resting BPM, peak BPM, sleep duration, and more. So that is the timeline. Keep scrolling down, keeps showing you this information for each day. It breaks it up into activities and then summary. If you go into metrics, here you can see different comparisons. It shows that right now my resting BPM is 85, which is lower than 12% of cardiogram users. My stand hours is 11, which is higher than 79% of cardiogram users. My move goal is 466, which is higher than 87%. 41 minutes of exercise is my average, which is higher than 86% of cardiograms users, and my average steps are 8,540. It also shows you your average sleep duration, your sleeping beats per minute, and it also shows you your trends for resting, stand, move, exercise, steps, sleep duration, and sleep BPM. For each of these charts, you can tap into any point to see a more detailed summary. Compared to other apps like HeartWatch, this app is more of an overview summary rather than a very detailed trend view. If you go to Care, you can actually have Cardiogram check some vitals and it'll alert you if it sees notices any um, changes in your heart rates or anything that um, looks abnormal. So to do that, you would just follow the steps and review medical history and allow them to um, view your history. You can go into habits and here you can sign up for different goals. So you can do like a daily bike ride, daily run, daily swim, moderate intensity activity. And this is with a whole bunch of different people. So you're kind of competing with a lot of different people. So it's a lot of fun. You can do some stress relief ones, some sleep quality ones and more. They're always adding more habits. So when you choose a habit, it'll let you know um, what the benefits of this habit are and the research study that's associated with it. To start it, you just tap start habit and now you press done and now it'll show up in and now it'll show up in your My Habits page. So here you see the daily walk. Did you walk for 30 minutes today? You would go ahead and enter your information here. Some of this, in this case, this one is an automatic one. There's also a premium membership for this. Now, premium membership for a cardiogram allows you to share your medical history and medical details with your friends and family. You can also share that with, um, with your doctor. So that can also be very handy. So that was a cardiogram app. This app is available on the App Store for free. It's also available on Android too with um, Wear OS watches. Um, I do highly recommend downloading this app. It provides really good complications for your Apple Watch and it also shows you a nice simple trend view of some of the data points that are being collected from your watch, like activity and heart rate. So I think this is a really cool app. Um, I would like to see more in-depth 
data points in this app, but since it is free, it's understandable. Um, there are some in-app purchases available that um, enhances some features and allows you to share with your doctors and some very close family members. So it is free on the App Store and Play Store, so feel free to check it out and comment down below and let me know what your experience is with the app. So that was Cardiogram. If you like this video, then please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. And if you really like this video, then go ahead and subscribe. Until next time, guys.